What's up everybody, this is Babes, and we are doing another Road to Glory season episode, but this time, instead of doing just another episode, I decided that I'm going to just put in the whole entirety of the regular season as we kick it off with the first game. I know you guys, those of you who have watched, have already seen the first game, but I figured if I'm going to do the entire season, I might as well add this game in, so... Let's get into it. As you can see, Harold Hamburger kicks it outside and runs all the way down inside the 10-yard line to the 5. Later on in the quarter, after that drive led to a touchdown, Hamburger gets it again and puts it in the end zone for a second time as they go up 14 to nothing. And really, they're just pouring it, just pouring it on at this point. As Hamburger just hurdles into the end zone, all cocky like, and the season starts off right at 1-0. A good, very good opener as Harold Hamburger really tore it up. So let's get into the second game as we are facing off against West St. Paul, and there was the kick and Hamburger is there to return all the way down to the 40 yard line later on in the drive Hamburger takes it right and he's got a lot of room but he gets out of bounds at somewhere around the 40 yard line West St. Paul later on gets into the end zone after we continually have problems with turning the ball over and as you can see, they're really just taking over the game right now. They get the pick six, and right here is another interception, as this one's looking bad. But then, Hamburger, there to save the day, picks up a huge play as he ends up running in the end zone. But back to that play, he forced the fumble on a game that looked like it was already over. But later on, it was just too late as a very frustrating game comes to Albert Lee as they end up falling to 1-1. One and one. Now, our first game on the road against Wilmer, and I'm using the left trigger action. As you can see, bouncing it outside on the kick return, getting to about the 28. And yet another interception right there, and then on this drive after that that interception led to a touchdown hamburger goes up almost across midfield but it ends up leading to a touchdown regardless so that nods it all up at seven and hamburger looking for his first interception in the high school level and he gets it in his senior year i don't know how he's done in his previous three seasons just i haven't got to play that but in this season senior season he's been great as hamburger looking to put albert lee back in front trying to get in the end zone as he does putting us up by four with less than two minutes to go the team's excited everyone's excited we're moving to two and one and hamburger is pumped about it now to the game versus hopkins and you know i'm not quite sure what uh what's going on here it's supposed to be a game in minnesota and it looks like it is arizona it looks like it's a desert i have no idea what's going on but hamburger chooks the guy out of his shoes to pick up the first touchdown of the game and then later on in the quarter runs down to the one yard line but that's okay because he wanted a receiving touchdown anyways hamburger 14 up 14 to 7 breaks it outside and he is gone or is he number 23 is catching up he's catching up but he cannot catch him you can't catch the hamburger he's too cheesy for you actually he's not cheesy because he's a hamburger and he's not a cheeseburger but on the read option hamburger gets into the end zone and now we're going for two to try and put them away Hamburger breaks it outside makes two defenders run into each other and we're moving on to three and one everybody's excited wasn't the greatest start that we could have had but it was sure uh, surely a decent start 
as Albert Lee coming back home facing off against Richfield in this game. Um, Hamburger breaks it outside on fourth down now, gets stuffed, and that ends up leading to a touchdown for Richfield. So it's, they're down seven nothing, but Hamburger answers on the other end, and Richfield comes right back at him with a touchdown of their own, and Hamburger then says, "I don't care, because it's gonna be a tie game." As he nods it up and then breaks it outside once again on the read option and takes the lead. Albert Lee out in front 21 to 14 as they end up tying the game and Hamburger here fumbling. You know how clutch Hamburger should be. So is this a fake video or something? I don't know. But Richfield takes the lead so Hamburger and Albert Lee have to answer. 28 to 21. The time is ticking, tick, 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 and they get in the end zone. It's Ostrander, but is it enough? Richfield coming down on the other end with five seconds to go, down to three. They take the timeout, and here is the kick, and they lose. And we're gonna take a quick listen wow. in that's at what game, Hamburger has sure to say won. after the game. Won. Very yeah. frustrated, obviously. We so let's take a listen. Um, smarter, better plays. Um, to win the rest of them, and um, it's, just, it's just frustrating. I wanted to stay in our hearts and keep hurting um, because this will motivate me um, uh, personally, and I think believe everybody else, coaches, and the rest of the players, uh, to never let something like this um, happen again, um, especially when we feel we're better than the team and um, don't play up to our ability. And uh, I just want to say one thing. Um, to the fans and everybody, I'm sorry, um, extremely sorry. You know, we were hoping for an undefeated season. That was my goal. But I promise you one thing, a lot of good will come out of this. You have never seen any player in the entire country play as hard as I will play the rest of the season, and you never see someone push the rest of the team as hard as I will push everybody the rest of the season, and you never see a team play harder than we will the rest of the season. God bless. Obviously, it's a very emotional press conference for Hamburger, and let's see if him and his team can answer the bell as they face off against South St. Paul. And Hamburger takes the kick return, runs over two players, and gets stuffed at the 25. As Hamburger breaks it outside and rumbles his way down to the 43-yard line, Another read option. Hamburger out on the loose. Could he be on? Yes, he is. Hamburger can do whatever he wants because he's a hamburger. Hamburger breaks it outside, runs over the defender, and stumbles his way down to the one-yard line as he eventually takes it into the end zone. And this could be the hamburger we've all been waiting for. Making defensive plays on a huge sack to hold him to three points. And Hamburger back on the offensive end. Really wants his team to succeed. As you can see, they're moving on to four and two after a dominant performance. So now they're facing off against Coon Rapids High School. And Hamburger takes it into the end zone, leading the charge. He will not let them lose. Won't happen. Or will it? I don't know. Let's figure it out. Hamburger takes it off to the right side and down at the 31 yard line. Some odd one going on. It's a draw. Hamburger takes it up the middle. Mows down a defender. Did you see that? Pause if you need. Because that was great. You can rewind and go back to that. Hamburger springing outside for a 52 yard gain. And he gets into the end zone for the touchdown. Hamburger on the read option. And he is off and running. And it's an easy touchdown for Hamburger as they rack up another victory. Up to 5-2. and two. Now to the next game against St. Cloud. As Hamburger looks to receive the punt after the defense holds them to three and out. Let's see what happens. He gets it. And he is stuffed. 
Amateur runs up the middle and he's just making his way for as many yards as he can, trying to do whatever he can, but they end up punting on the possession. But it's okay because the defense holds them and they're getting the ball back. Here comes Harold Hamburger and stuffed on the return. This is a very tough game. Hamburger on the catch, gets the first down, picks it up. That's what we needed. And yet again, he's fighting his way for the yards, trying to do whatever he can. Let's see what can happen in this one. Hamburger gets another reception. And is it gonna go to him? No, it is not, but it's in the end zone for a touchdown. And it's tied up at seven at half. Albert Lee on the return with Hamburger and stuffed at the 20. As he takes it inside, cuts back behind the defender and is across to the 40 yard line. And it's a dive play and Hamburger just rumbles his way for the first down. Yet another dive and he's stumbling and bumbling down inside the 20. Hamburger gets it down to the run. No, he's in for the touchdown. They take the lead. They get the ball back and they end up getting stopped for a field goal. But that's okay. It's 17 to 7. They are moving up to 6 and 2. That's what they wanted. They wanted at least 6 wins and they got it. So now is the moment of truth. Are they going to have a perfect season since the famous, the one and only, the hamburger speech? Hamburger gets it and runs the return to the 20 yard line. It's a fake reverse and he runs through the defender to the 35. And he just is so good at fighting for yards even though he's supposed to be a speed back. He's showing some signs of power, explosiveness. Adrian Peterson, some might say, as he takes the read option and picks up a bunch of yards down to the 47 yard line as it's another read option and Hamburger is on the loose could he be gone two guys to beat and they ran into each other one dives into the other and Hamburger prances into the end zone and that was big as it ends up being a tie game as Albert Lee keeps fighting and keeps fighting they need to score here to take the lead and they do Hamburger makes his way into the end zone and now we need to play defense as we do not and they get back at us into the end zone Colombian Heights putting up a great fight as we need a quick drive with under four minutes to go can we do it oh it's gonna be fourth and one we need a big play from hamburger here we go he picks up the first down and he ends up on the draw Jutting into the end zone for the touchdown. 24 to 21. That is a huge play. 55 seconds remaining. What's gonna happen? It's picked off and it's over. They're gonna do it. They're gonna do it. Seven and two. Some say it was impossible. Hamburger just said, I want cheese. I wanna become a cheeseburger. Give me that cheese. But I promise you one thing, a lot of good will come out of this. You have never seen any player in the entire country play as hard as I will play the rest of the season, and you never see someone push the rest of the team as hard as I will push everybody the rest of the season, and you never see a team play harder than we will the rest of the season. God bless.